Oh, this is a teaser. This is not instruction. Don't go and buy one of these off of eBay and do this at your house, right? <laughs> That's true. Now, right. that said, and this is really crucial, this is a lot harder than it looks. It can kill you, but it's so totally worth it. <laughs> is that good? Hey guys, welcome to Flight Test. I'm Alex and this is Josh. Hi. And recently we started doing a new form of uh, content all around general aviation. Yes, and if you guys remember our Oshkosh Air Adventure episode, we are really inspired by a group called Paradigm mm -hmm. that put on the first aerobatic paramotor display. Yeah, and those were the guys from Aviator PPG, which is based out of Florida yes. um, in the Orlando area. And recently we had the awesome opportunity to go down and spend some time with the guys and learn all about paramotors. Yes, and one of the biggest building blocks of paramotor is something called kiting, and we got to try that out. This is a basic pre-flight of our wing right here. We're, we're inspecting the surface of the wing, the upper surface, the lower surface. We're inspecting all the lines, making sure that they're clear, not damaged. All right, so a couple things that we want to talk about really quickly. Um, because this is not a full training, this is just a come out, we're gonna hang out for half an hour and see how it goes. Yeah. I'm gonna give you guys a quick explanation of what I'm going to do, then I'm gonna show you, then you're gonna do it yourself. Normally this would be a four to five hour ground school course as you get started. So as you guys come back and actually go through the full training, you'll see a very different side of it. But for you guys and for your audience, they're gonna get an idea of what this looks like, how it feels. You might even get your feet off the ground, which is the best feeling right. ever. Now forward inflation means we're running away from the wing, inflating it, releasing the A's once it comes all the way up, adding brake pressure to control the wing, and moving toward a target, all right? That target will actually be me in front of you, running really silly backwards, all right? One thing that most pilots do when they first get started in this is they think strength. It's the opposite. You are dancing with this wing, and this wing is the man of the relationship. Let it lead you, move softly, and be smooth. That will probably become a meme. Um, but <laughs> in all seriousness, you want to be as smooth as you can be, and it's purposeful because the easier you can be with the wing, letting it move your body. If the wing moves right, you move right, right with it. If it moves left, you move left with it. We have a thing with our whole class. There'll be six or eight of you out there, and we actually have you dance with a pretend wing, and it's, it's really cute. Building the wall, right? Building the wall. Light pressure. Letting the wing move me. Everything feels pretty good. Land it nicely right there. I'm gonna walk forward so I have slack. We always be looking down at the risers, not out. If we're looking out at the risers, the wing's ready to fly. And we don't have the brakes in our hands, so we're actually a passenger on a one-seat aircraft. That's not a place you wanna be. No. All right, now that I have done that, I'm making sure all the lines are straight. Again, smooth and slow, some slack. We drop it with the A's outside, so you know the wing's ready to fly. Very cool. You ready? <laughs> you know what's funny? I was like all really amped in the sight. Like, this is gonna happen. You got it, man. Now he said the words, are you ready? <laughs> <laughs> and it changes everything. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, you know what? I'm, I'm not gonna back out now. <laughs> all, right. all right. I'm gonna do a couple things for you. Yeah. First off, I'm gonna put this in your thumb like this. Okay. Because our goal here is keep your hands away from it. When I say release, you're gonna open your thumbs and let this come off, okay? Okay, the, these are the uh, the A's, or the those brake. Are the, those are the A's. These are the A's. The brake's gonna stay in your hand. You're just gonna release, okay, release the A's release when I say release the A's. the A's. And I'm gonna hold them like this and then just drop them. That's right. Now another thing that's important here, see where your arms are right now? Yeah. We call this the Superman. Superman. Because your arms are forward. Okay. Right? Da, 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 da. <laughs> we want your arms back, like, like this. you're holding a quarter between your shoulder blades. Okay. So you're just, uh, all right? All right. Good, so deep breath. Try to make your movement smooth. You're not gonna use strength. You're not gonna push your arms forward. You keep your arms back. Okay. No strength, just walking toward me. All right, here we go. Are you ready? Toward me a little faster. Hands back, run faster, run faster, move left, run faster, run faster, run faster, run faster, run faster, run faster. Run fast. All oh, right. <laughs> more speed, more speed. More speed. Left, left pressure touch. A little more speed. Touch. Smaller input, smaller input. Well, it doesn't take that much. Pressure both, pressure both. More speed. Pressure. Yeah. Good. Keep it nice and steady. Very nice. Take a deep breath. Look at your wingtip. Look at that wingtip. See how that feels? Fine, buddy. That's Add pressure again. Big pressure all the way down. Turn around, face the wind. Keep that pressure down. Keep that pressure down. Right hand all the way down. Right hand. <laughs> oh, sorry, buddy. <laughs> Nice oh work. my God! <laughs> That's such Alex, a feeling. you gotta try. That was incredible. <laughs> Thank you for Great the extra job, muscle. Man. It's the best feeling ever. <laughs> that was incredible. <laughs> and I tangled up your lines. You did great. No, they're not tangled. That's the cool oh thing. Oh my gosh! Okay. If you don't do anything at all, if you kept this brake in your hand the whole time, mm -hmm. both brakes in the hands. Okay. You're ready to fly again. Nothing's changed. Nothing's it's changed. It's not tangled because it's all connected on both ends. Isn't that cool? 
my heart is racing so hard. <laughs> and I don't know if it's because the second he pushed me, my butt went off the ground and they got a taste of what that would feel like or I'm just out of shape. <laughs> first inflation, and I gotta say, like yeah, at first, yeah. your inputs were big, you dropped the A's before I told you to, which is why oh. we had to run so hard because the wing was hanging back. Gotcha. So next time we'll hold the A's until I say release. Okay. Just be a good robot. Try to use exactly the timing because we'll give you that timing ahead of time. Yeah. Eventually it becomes automatic. Wow. That's incredible. All you feel is like a pull. You just feel it like an even steady pull on this. I was thinking you're going to be, it's mostly what you feel like in the shoulders. It feels yeah. like with the. Oh yeah, you'll start to feel, and you'll feel if it gets light, you need to add pressure. If it gets too heavy, the wing's sinking, it's slowing down, you let off the pressure. Everything becomes natural. Incredible. <laughs> that was incredible. Now you got this beautiful airplane pulling up. Which would you rather be flying right now? <laughs> Heck yeah. Don't call me a traitor, guys. I'm sorry, but this is awesome. <laughs> Two steps back, deep breath. Good, hands are back this time. Really focus on the hear my words. I'm gonna walk with you, okay? Okay. More speed, more speed, more speed, more speed. Ah. The Pressure, right there. Feel the balance side. You're gonna have more power, more speed. More power, power, power. <laughs> Pressure both, pressure, 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 pressure. Whoa! Yeah, right, turn around, turn around, duck underneath your eyes, duck underneath, duck underneath, duck underneath your head. Yeah! <laughs> left break all the way Oh, down. left break, left yeah. break. Yeah! <laughs> that was better than the first. Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh. Isn't that cool? Uh, I'm gonna wear a baby harness like this to bed. <laughs> oh my gosh. ask some questions. Yes, it's okay. <laughs> all right, Alex, you ready for this? Yeah. I don't know. I, I, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do as good as you. You're gonna do great. You did awesome. So our goal is to come back here and to actually go through the full training because part of a pilot's journey, plus can we fly it, is not just can we have limited success, but what can we do it and what's it like. So hopefully, maybe around May, if you guys want to, we'll be coming back here again, going through full training, yeah. and eventually saying hi to each other a couple hundred feet up, right? <laughs> awesome. And by the way, if I haven't said it already, thank you guys for making this possible for us. Walk forwards, we feel a small bump, just a little bump right about there. Perfectly centered, two more steps back now. You feeling good? Yeah. You feeling ready? Yeah. All right, keep your arms back, try to remember not to use strength, just using smooth movement. Mm -hmm. Come to me. A little more speed, a little more speed. Faster, faster, reduce the A's. Run to me, reduce the A's in your thumb. Let off those A's. Let off the A's, let off the A's. Pull your hands away from the A's. There, there you go. go. Yeah. There, now you can feel the wing. A little bit of pressure just yeah. right there. A little more speed, run faster, run faster, run faster, run faster. Pressure, both. pressure, 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 hands down, hands down, hands down, hands down. Right there, perfect. Keep it up, keep it down, come down. And both all the way down, run forward, <laughs> turn around, duck underneath the riser, duck underneath, duck underneath, right straight all the way down. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> we got one. Got the GoPro. <laughs> got the GoPro. Oh my gosh. That was sick, dude. That was awesome. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> Both of you guys first time. That was wicked. Very cool. I right, one thing to keep in mind, always well, hold on. Keep the brakes in your hands or yep. on the magnets. It's ozone to ozone. Gotcha. Like because when you drop them, mm -hmm. this is how it's all we tangled. get all tangled up. Right? Yep. These wings are super easy to keep straight if you make the right decisions. Yeah. <laughs> that was Thanks great. Work. That was great. That was really cool. All right, you want to try something harder? Uh, sure, sure. <laughs> So the forward launch like that is super awesome because you get in the air. But in moderate winds like this, the majority of what you'll do is actually reverse kiting like he is. I don't expect to lay on the ground and ace it. Yeah. But what I want you to think, keep in mind, let's walk forward first so we have slack. Okay. If the wing moves right, go ahead and put your hands like this. This will be about where you're holding them. Okay. A little bit lower, right about there. Okay. The wing moves right, you move toward it, and pull the hand you're moving toward. So wing moves right, you move right, and, and, and pull on this right one. pressure. Okay. And make sure your left hand goes up so you're actually basically like, like pistons, mm -hmm. right? So the wing moves left, left pressure, mm -hmm. left movement. Mm -hmm. Move first, pressure later. Okay. Okay. It's just like flying an RC plane. So like when you fly a plane out and you turn around, you're flying back. Right. You push the wing into towards. You prop up the table. Yeah. That's a great explanation. That's probably why RC guys do well because I've actually tried to understand why, and because you're basically reversing your brain when you're flying yeah. it towards you. Yeah. Same idea. So reverse your brain, prop the table up. What we oftentimes will say is, don't think of the lines as being something you can pull on. Think of them as, as if they're solid, and you're forcing one the low side up by propping it up or pushing it up with a, like nice. a stick. 
Gotcha. Cool. Awesome. Okay. All right. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to make sure that we keep our, our body movement smooth. We're not going to try to pull the glider up with our hips. Yep. You're still going to pull it up with your hips. You're going to mm-hmm. use strength. We're going to use smoothness, like we're dancing. Okay. So nice and steady. Move back fast. Move back faster. Move back. Release the A's. Pressure both. More left hand than right. More left hand. More left hand. Not too much. Think about the stall point. As that wing starts to curve, pressure both. More right hand than left. Too much pressure, about half and off. Right hand more, off the left hand. Off the left hand, move your body right. Very nice, smooth pressure now. Left pressure a bit more than right. Both pressures about one inch more. And maintain pressure. Right pressure, one inch. Off the left. Release left, release left. Very good. Look down here at your hands. Uh-huh. The risers tell you all the same information. So look down here. This would be off brakes, uh-huh. right? That would be on brakes. It's not much difference in feel, Yeah. but the wing feels it, especially yeah. in moderate wind like this. Very nice, move right, release that left hand. Release left, only hold right. Only hold right, Hold off that left. There you go, now pressure both. Good, a little more left and right, more left and right. Take a breath. <sighs> Sorry, lots of information at once. Yeah, yeah, You're doing awesome. I want RC pilots from now on. <laughs> Moving toward it, pulling toward it. Keep your speed moving backwards to keep your airspeed up. Excellent, a little more right pressure off that left. Right pressure, move backwards. Move backwards, keep the right pressure. Keep moving toward it, moving toward it to the right. All right break, all the way down right break. Right break behind you. Right break behind you. There you go. That was great. I think our sea pilots are magic. Honestly, like you can't say the word amazing enough times. Yeah. But the, the way you, I thought it was gonna feel like you're gonna get grabbed up and pulled up right here. Mm-hmm. No, you literally feel like someone's just like touching you on the bottom yeah. and just kind of lifting you up. Now it was a marine for a moment. Yeah. But <laughs> but besides that, it, it, it it's incredible. And I, I want to say it's like riding a bike, not in the sense that it's super easy, it's um, easy, because like when I learned how to ride a bike with my dad, I crashed a ton of times. So it's the same as that. But I could feel how it could become supernatural to be able to do it. We're set in the middle, left step, good. Move back fast. Release, pressure more right, more right, more right. Put off that left a little bit. Okay. Move your body up, breathe more right, let off the left. Put off the left a little higher. There you go, perfect. Nice speed, everything really good. Keep breathing, move smooth. Pressure both about one more inch, right there. Just feel it up, see how that feels? <laughs> yes. You start to feel the lift a little bit? Yep. Put a more right hand, with a left left. More right hand. Good. Look at me. Keep breathing. You can feel what the wings do. A little more pressure on both. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> light pressure, not too oh. much. Look up the wing. Right pressure more than light. Pressure on both. Remember, while you're maintaining pressure, it's good. Right hand right, right only. Right hand all the way down. Other right. Other right. Right hand all the way down. Move your body right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh! I'm really not. I know that. <laughs> when you said look down, I was like, hey, I'm not looking away for that wing. <laughs> so why do you want me to stop looking at the wing? But as soon as you do, and you trust me to give you the right yeah. inputs, it really translated. You went from yeah. sitting like this with your mouth open. There's a mo- an element of fear because you can't see what you're doing. Yeah. You can't experience it. As soon as you look forward and are able to center your body, that's mm-hmm. why we talk about that deep breath. It sounds really like no, it makes woo-woo. sense. But dude, it makes a big difference. It oh. really does. And you're right, the second you take your eyes off of it, you start trusting how it feels. Yep. And of course the instructor. Makes a big difference. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, that man. was the most incredible first experience. And when you talk about like you go in more in depth, it sounds like it'd just be more of a reward because you understand more. It definitely gets better and better. Well, that was an incredible experience. Incredible is a good way to say it. We can't thank Aviator PPG enough for having us down. Um, And let us know in the comments. Like I said, we just went through a little crash course. Uh, They they just barely had enough time to get us in, so we were down there for a couple days, and it was quite the experience. Let us know in the comments below if you'd like to see us go down there and complete the full course and actually go all the way to solo because the guys at Aviator PPG are awesome instructors. So far with the general aviation content, what you've seen is uh, pilot and plane, the relationships and why the pilots love the airplane that they choose to fly in. Also, we've shown things like Ask the Experts, where it was with Aviator PPG, mm-hmm. all around paramotors and just, you know, the, the science behind it. This is really kind of a different format too, where it's a pilot's journey. We want to go through the uh, aspect of learning a different aspect of flight mm-hmm. and share our experience, not necessarily how to do it, but the value of the training and also the experience we have along the way to hopefully inspire you to take on a similar path. If you guys are new to Flight Test, uh, we do episodes like this all the time. You actually caught one of our general aviation episodes where we cover all aspects of general aviation and all kinds of approachable ways to get into general aviation. It turns out powered paragliders is one of the most approachable ways out there. Yes. Um, but we do all things that fly, including our seat. That's one of our, that's how that's we our started. our main one. Yeah. So we do drones, <laughs> FPV, 
yep. airplanes, helicopters. We DIY teach you. builds, crazy challenges, projects. Mm -hmm. We even teach you how to do DIY plans built out of common materials like foam board from the dollar store, popsicle sticks, barbecue skewers. You can build an airframe for like less than five bucks, which is pretty awesome. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, make sure you do so. Also hit the little bell button right next to it because uh, that little notification bell will let you know every time we come out with new content because we're doing six plus videos a week now. Yep. Thanks so much for watching, being part of the family. We'll see you next time. See you guys. Fly.